Hey guys, it's Revy here, and I'm recording a uh, playthrough of the game Undertale, which um, I'm pretty excited to do this because this is probably one of my favorite games that I've ever witnessed play, or played and witnessed played. Um, but I'm going to go over a few things before I start getting into the gameplay itself because I'll probably be more concentrating on the game itself than talking about it. So I want to talk about a few things. First of all, I just played like 20 minutes of 23 minutes and then I realized or and recorded it of this and I realized I didn't for some reason didn't record my voice so that was a little irritating so I'm doing this again so um anyway but this game is awesome it breaks the fourth wall in a lot of ways and, and it has a lot to do with you saving and loading your saves and you'll see what I mean later on down the road but in the beginning um this game is made by Toby Fox as you can see down the bottom amazing creation I have to give him a lot of credit for this and also Temi, T-E-M-M-I-E, I think is what it's spelled, I don't know what her first name is, but she's another chick who helped him with the game mainly, it was just them two, mainly, for the most part. Um, props to both of them for this amazing game. Um, but I need to get into something, I'm doing the pacifist run, now the pacifist run, as you can probably tell by the, by the naming, you run, is there's, well, there's two main ways you can get in, get to an ending. Main first way is the pacifist run, which is you don't kill anybody, you, you literally, you don't fight nor kill anybody, and um, you run through mercying, giving everyone mercy, and and basically being a pacifist the whole entire time. And it'll lead through in one ending, and that's the pacifist, pacifist ending. And I've watched that, I've watched my friend play the whole entire game through the pacifist ending, all the way to the end, so I've watched this whole entire game through the pacifist way, so I know everything's gonna happen that you're gonna see. So, um, I'm not really gonna get surprised by anything, unless it's something that I just didn't remember, but I mean, all, I, I've played this game, I've, I've watched this game, you played it all the way through. Now, the genocide run, I've watched a little bit, but I have not watched nothing close all the way through, because this game is a long game. Um very very complex game but if you get all the insight data and all the little signs of picking you, you're supposed to be picking up on all the little a lot of foreshadowing this game uses it's just so amazing um anyway oh, let me itch my ear um just gonna i was putting that out there anyway the, also the, and, uh, and then the other way you can play the game is a genocide run and basically you're killing everyone that is good or bad and everyone you're just killing everyone and basically um, the game, basically, um, um, everyone sees you as a horrible monster, human being, which, ba a horrible human being, which you basically are, because you're killing everyone, of, sig of, of significance, good or bad, just, and everyone sees you as a horrible person, as opposed to the pacifist run, everyone sees you as, I guess, okay, they don't really care, I guess they think you're good when you get through the end, anyway, I'm not gonna ruin anything, but, yeah, the genocide run, you kill everyone, and you kill well, yeah you kill everyone and you get a whole other ending and you basically play a whole different kind of game that's basically what it is but this game is amazing and i'm going to say one more thing before i jump in here the reason i'm recording i'm able to record and upload now is because i bought something that i can actually record with and it's called action if you don't know what that is it's a recording obviously it's a recording thing for my um pc so yeah but the reason I wasn't able to record PC stuff the whole entire time, this whole entire time, was my mic mainly. I have a good mic. I have a, I have a good headset. I record with my headset. Um, I have a Logitech G930. But, um, it's nothing great for commentary recording. Like, when I try to record on Xbox 360, or the Pop Hog Capture, when I try to record voice on that, it sounds horrible. But if, if I speak loudly, it sounds horrible. And when I tried to record game with Fraps, my voice was fine, but... The main issue being was that um, every time I would record for like three or four seconds, or no, I'd record for like maybe 20, 15 seconds, and it'll, it'll, it would stop recording automatically. And it was the free fast version, so I didn't really expect it to work the right, right way. Plus, it had the um, watermark in it, or whatever it's called. It said fraps.com up at the top. And same with Bandicam. Bandicam was giving me issues too. It was just not recording. It didn't look good when I rec finished recording. It would be all laggy when in the end result. So I bought it. Uh, so long story short, action works, works fine with my mic, and I can record. And, and it works fine recording, and it's also helpful because I don't have to use the timer. At the top right, it says the time, how long I've been recording. Right now, I've been recording for a minute, or four minutes and 52 seconds. Dear God, that's been a long time of me talking. Anyway, enough of this. I'm going to jump in now. Reset. Yes.
pay attention to all the foreshadowing and stuff in this game. I mean, I'll I'll point a lot of stuff out to you guys because this is a playthrough. But um, yeah. Okay, I'm a human. I dropped onto a flower pedest pedestal, flowers, or whatever you want to say. In through the column we go. Uh, don't you have anything? Don't you have anything better to do? See that heart? That's your soul. The very accumulation of your being. Your soul starts weak, but can be strong if you gain lots of LV. What's LV stand for? Why love, of course. You want some love, don't you? Well, don't worry, I'll share some with you. Down here, love is shared through little white friendship pel or friendliness pellet suit. Excuse me. Are you ready? Move around. Get as many as you can. I'm gonna tell you guys. Actually, I was supposed to let them hit me because they're kind of magnetically attracted. But he goes, "Hey, buddy, you missed them. It's pretty funny." So there's, you have to inevitably let them hit you because it's part of the game. You idiot. This is war in this world. It's kill or be killed. Why would you? Why would anyone pass an opportunity like this? Die. This shot. This game. I'm telling you guys, is nothing shy of amazing. If you can, you can go buy it in Steam for ten dollars. It's that's what I did. It's cheap. What a terrible creature! Such a poor, or hurting such a poor innocent, innocent youth. Ah, do not be afraid, my child. I am Toriel. Also, create. First of all, caretaker of the ruins, but also Toriel. Tutorial. Get it? A little board play right there, because she's mainly the person who gives you the t tutorial of the game. Pass through this place. I've. I pass through this place every day. See if anyone has fallen down. You are the first human to come through in a long time. Come, I will guide. I will guide you through the com comatomes. Also, I'll give you guys a quick rundown on the controls, just in case you're wondering. You can either use the arrow keys. You can't use WASD. Use the arrow keys for moving your person around, like I was doing, and also for walking and movement. And then also, you can use the enter button or Z for yes or for enter to select something, and then X to go through, to select through things faster. And also, it means no as well. X, so Z and X are like yes and no, and then C is a uh, menu like that. So anyway, back off of that. Using the arrow keys, and then, yeah, that's it. You don't use the mouse or anything for that. Just arrow keys and W, you no, know, no, like Z, X, C, your three fingers. Welcome to your new move, your two, new home, innocent one. Allow me to introduce you the opportun the operation of the ruins. Okay, this is loud and putting the sound a little bit. The ruins are part of or full of puzzles. No shit. Ancient puzzles between diversions and door keys. Or doorways, I don't know why I said door keys. I'm tired. It's like three something in the morning right now. I'm gonna go right after I'm done doing this, I'm gonna render it and upload the videos that are recorded today. Because I also recorded a first episode of my Minecraft survival series too, so that'll go up and this will go up at the same time. Or the same night I mean. After I'm done with this I'm probably gonna go to bed. Tired. Anyway, back to the game. One must move. One must solve them to move from room to room. Please, I'm gonna step back on my computer because I'm really close up to it. Please adjust yourself to the side of them. Uh, okay. I see that. That sounds like Pokemon music in the back almost. To make progress here, you will need to trigger several switches. You do not worry. I have labeled the ones you need to flip. Okay, that one's already up, and this one's. Wait a minute. Oh yeah, that's right. That one didn't make a sound. Oh, that's right, because I didn't open the door until I hit the second one. Right. Splendid, I am proud of you, little one. Make move to the next room. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, it's a human living in the underground. Watch by attack you. You will need to be prepared for the situation. However, don't be worried. The process, I didn't read it because I skipped. Big new encounter monster will clear a fight. But see if you hit X. If I, if I had just hit Z like that, it just goes through. But if I had X, it'll go through the whole thing like that. I'll practice on dumbing, and I will come in to save you. Blah, blah, It's pretty much what, it is, what she said. Back in the battle screen. Act. Dummy, talk. It doesn't seem much for conversation. Toriel seems happy with you. You won, cause and you didn't win any gold because. Okay, let me go through this. You didn't win any gold because you're in the tutorial thing and she's walking you around. You you will win gold once you're by yourself. And um, you don't win XP until you kill until you kill people. And you don't ever kill people. So basically, you stay zero level for level one throughout the whole entire game because you don't kill anything, which is fine because you don't fight. So yeah, you don't need XP. I wonder if you can solve it. All I have to do is walk straight. It's not like it's anything difficult. But there's a, there's a monster come up right there. Oop, it's a froggit. Act froggit. Compliment. Oop. Froggit doesn't understand what you said, but it's flattered anyway. And then Toy looks all pissed off. Froggit and Froggit's sad face. You won. You earn zero XP and zero gold. What does this say? 
The western room is built on the eastern room's blueprint. Alright, she leads you through this one. This is okay. I'm just gonna skip through that kind of fast. I'm I'm sorry, you look for you. I'm growing impatient after doing this a couple times. And also the first the first time I went through this, I hit the windows though it didn't halfway like three quarters of the way through. And had to like split it up because I didn't mean to. I hit the windows button and automatically stopped the recording. Um, plus it'll seem a little too dangerous for now. You have done excellent for uh, you have done excellent uh, excellently thus far, my child. However, I have difficulty or I have difficult request for you. Walk through this room by yourself. It'll prove your. And then at the end, you get through, and she'll be like, "This this is just to prove your independence." Even though it's the fucking longest room in the history of ever. I feel like my, my, ring, my I feel like my left my right ring finger is about to fall off because that's the finger that's on the right index key. Hey to hey toil. Greetings, my child. Don't worry. You merely the pillar of the whole time. Ha. Got you. Well, thank you for trusting me over the important reason of exercise to attest your independence. Like I said, I must attend. I must attend to some business, and I must leave you alone for some time or for a while. Please remain here. It's too dangerous to be alone by yourself. I have an idea. I'll give you some. If you have any, if you have a need for anything, just call. Be good. All right. Yep, we'll do. Just gonna leave right behind you, even though you told me not to. And she's just fucking gone. Ring. Hello, from the tutorial. You haven't left the room, have you? Yes, I have. There are a few puzzles that I have yet to explain. I will be dangerous, or it will be dangerous to try to solve them yourself. Be good, alright? Will do, Captain. Hey, Frogget, what's up? Everybody, excuse me, human. If you have some advice for, or I have some advice for you about the monsters, or about battling monsters. If you act a certain way, you fight until you can almost defeat them. They might not want to fight battle you anymore. A monster might fight you, please. Mercy, yep, see if they're- Oh, I forgot to hit on that too. You'll see this in combat, but I'm gonna elaborate anyway. When you fight, and if you- Like like it's saying right here, if you- If their name, whatever their, their name is, like this one's Froggit, so if you're fighting Froggit and their name glows- Glows, um, yellow like it says in Mercy, you go to Mer- You go to Mercy and you can hit Spare, and then it'll let you flee them. That's what, pretty much what you're doing to everyone this whole entire game. You're mercying them for the whole entire game. But this this ending is amazing. Um, anyway, playfully cri okay, playfully crinkling through. Oh God, I can't fucking pronounce. Playfully crinkling through through the leaves fills you with determination. HP fully restored. Okay, I didn't mean to full diamond. Oh, I didn't know you. It, it filled your HP all the way when you went through that. Ah, oh, interesting. Frog it up close. Here we go. My first one on one encounter. Frog it. Compliment. Okay, this is the first actual thing I had to do. This is basically the fight screen. Um, you have to avoid whatever is on the screen, unless it's different colors, but then we'll get that, we'll get that down the road. Um, seems reluctant to fight you, let's see, yep, and you can hit Mercy, and see, if you go to, well, I didn't get to show you because I accidentally hit Z, but if you went to his name, it would have been, lo um, glowing up, um, yellow. I'm pretty sure falling down there is inevitable, I don't, I'm pretty sure there's no way to walk through there without doing that, unless I'm just stupid and do it wrong every time. Hello, this tutorial for no reason in particular. Which do you prefer, cinnamon or butterscotch? Wait, do not tell me, is it butterscotch? I'm gonna hit no, every other time I've done it, I'm it, yes. Oh, I see. Well, thank you for telling me goodbye for now. Yep, hello, this is tutorial. You do not like, dislike butterscotch, do you? I know what your preference is, but do you, would you turn up your nose if you found, you know, if you found it on your plate? All right, I understand, thank you for be being patient, by the way. Well, I'm not exactly being patient considering I left, you know. I'm gonna read this. I'm curious. And I knew that was gonna happen. Act. Frog it. And compliment. Okay. Back to the easy frog it battle screen. And see if you want to act. See it's yellow like I said. And then I hit X and I can go back to here. Hit spare. Spare and boom and I get gold because I'm by myself like I said. Hello. Do you not have any allergies do you? Huh? Why am I asking? No reason. No reason at all. Yeah, and if you hit X, it'll go through really fast like I am in the talking things. Alright, let's see if I can get through this first trial like I did last time. Okay, I go all the way down, and then I go- Oh, damn it! I know how far to not go over now. That thing, that sign just says, don't step on the, um, yellow flower, or blue flower. No! The flowers that I was just stepping on. It says not to, even though I just did. I'm just gonna approach the meek- Approach meekly. Oh, I know how to do this one, ready? You hit- Oh, wait, and he's already- 
doesn't want to fight you, right? Sweet. I can just spare you right on top, right? Swag. And I guess I gotta go up here. And then I know I gotta go all the way to the flowers, go down, go right, and just go up here. And there we go. Okay, this is where it starts to get a little funny. I don't I've mentioned this game, but it's pretty funny. And I didn't mean to hit fight. Act. Oh, I can already receive. This game is really, really funny. And you guys, you guys will understand the sense of humor if you haven't already seen it. But I like this right here. What was our partner? Who said you could push me around? Hmm. Oh, I didn't read that. Okay, just, just for you, pumpkin. Mm hmm. You want me to remove some more? All right. How's this? You some of a bitch. Hmm. That was the wrong direction. Okay, I kind of got it. That's what I fucking thought. All right, now watch. Ready? He's gonna do something extremely sarcastic and funny. Ready? You fucking asshole. You wanted me to stay there. You're giving me a real workout. You fucking moved me. I'm the one moving around all the time. You're fucking rocky just sit there. All right, I gotta listen to the cheese and talk about determination. Check this shit out. Ready? Knowing that the mouse might one day leave its hole and get the cheese fills you with determination. See, like that kind of funny. It's just random as shit, but it's pretty. I don't know how to explain that thing. Like this. The cheese has been there for quite a long time. It's stuck to the table. Like really dry, but it's funny. Quiz is dry. This ghost keeps saying "see" out loud repeatedly. Move it with force. You have to yes, because if you didn't know, it'll just make you go through that skim skim again. Nothing changes. It snaps a blue. Act. I'm gonna flirt with you, honey. I just weigh you down. That's what he said. I know I skipped through. I gotta stop going so fast, rushing through, because I gotta let you guys absorb this whole entire game. All right. That's a blue cheer. You give him a patient smile. Heh. <laughs> I'm not really feeling up to it right now. Sorry. Act. Cheer. Hehe. <laughs> Act. Cheer. He wants to say something. I call it Dappa Bluke. Dappa Bluke, I think it was pronounced. Dappa Bluke. Do you like it? Hell yeah, I like it. Because if I dislike it. But if I dislike it, you're probably going to cut yourself. So, just to be sure, I'm going to. Actually, if you flirt, it's pretty funny. He's just like, oh no. And he gets all sad. Like he always is. I usually come to the Bruins because there's nobody around. But today I met somebody nice. Aw, even me. Oh, I'm rambling again. I'll get out of your way. Mm. Okay, bye. Now, if I go to the right, there's nothing here but the spider bake sale. Spider bake sale hope you see all four seats. Go to real spiders. Oh my god, my hands are fumbling all over the keyboard. Man, it's already been 17 minutes. And... No, it's 18 minutes. Did you visit the spider bake sales down to the right? Come eat spiders, four spiders. Come eat food made by spiders, four spiders by of spiders. Ribbit, ribbit, I heard from, I heard using a four, you can make your screen. Oh, I didn't read that the first time, because I asked my friend how to make it full screen. I had to text him. This is troubling to, I have it full screen, by the way, just, you probably can't tell. I don't know if you can or not, but I have it full screen. Ribbit, ribbit, I have to. I heard you were incredibly merciful for a human. Yep, see, merciful. So if I was killing everyone, I don't think he'd say that. I'm not assuming. Surely you know by now, monster, yellow, spirit, yep. Very helpful. Um, okay, bye. What you want? I just realized that it's been a while since I have cleaned up. Okay, I think I'm gonna go until next, um, because it doesn't make any sense, because you literally, there's no autosave or anything. Those little stars that I walked up to, that, that, that'd be the last time I load off on when I, when I come back to it next time, so I'm just gonna go and keep recording and keep this video going until I get to the next, um, star, whatever it's called, save point. So I'm gonna keep going, even though it's only 19 minutes. So, I mean, oh well, uh, I was not expecting to see companies so soon, there are probably a lot of things laying around here and there, but you can pick them up, but do not carry more than you need, someday it might be something you really like, you will need, you will want to leave room in your pockets for that, thanks Toriel, for that tutorial, I don't know if you heard it, but I did like a, whatever that's called, rim shot, that's what it's called, but I just kind of did it on my desk, Vegetoy came out of the earth, here we go, Dinner, I can actually give myself XP for this, even though I already have full XP, so it's not exactly open. Alright, now I can use Mercy and Flu- and Spare Hit. Oh, I'm hitting Z, am I not? There you go. Okay, if you read this... What is it? Oop, that's not the- There's just one switch. That's nice. I know where the switch is, right here. Oops, I hit the wrong button. 
Dang it. No. <clears throat> Sounded like a fucking explosion, dear goodness. But it's me. Luke's Jr. Let's fucking do this, Luke. I'm gonna capture you like a fucking Don't pick on. Finally someone gets it, I think is what he says. Wow, that's really OW! Oh yeah, that's right, I get spare now. Oh! This is staring right through you, I think is one of the things it says. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and go through these real fast. I'm gonna read this just for you guys' sake, even though I really don't want to, because I know that the, the far does not is not an exit. It's simply a marks a rotation in perspective. Cause, so you guys have to pay attention to how that room is because it'll change perspective but it's the same room and you have to figure out puzzles and figure out where the switches are and stuff but it's easy stuff act oh, I can already spare okay this one's easy I don't have to do anything and then I'm pretty sure if I can yep there we go now I'll go through here I know I have to hit this this little green switch behind here but if you read the wall, I'm pretty sure. If you read the wall, I'm pretty sure it says press the green switch. So let me double check. Blue switch is right. It's a blue switch, not green. But yeah, there's a blue switch behind that panel. A pair of vegetoids came out for the ground. Okay, let's. I didn't mean to fight. Oh, I didn't mean to fight. Okay, well, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if you fight. Just once. Well, it doesn't matter if you fight because as long as you don't kill them, you're fine. But you can kill up to, I believe, ten, without it triggering, without it not. Registering a, as a pacif pacifist run, and then you'll have to go through the whole entire thing and go back through pretty much It'll make it really annoying if I killed more than that. So yeah There's Ten or more. I'm not sure how it works, but it's ten anyway Act Vegetoid you eat dinner and it'll give you If you get the green things it'll get you ex or not XP health and I'm getting wrecked it All right, bye Vegetoid Ow! Ow! Why am I stupid? Okay. Can I mercy you yet? Nope. Act. Dinner. Give me something. Eat your greens. Literally. That was pretty funny. Ha ha ha. That's like the third time I've been that dumb joke tonight. Anyway. Vegetoid gave a mysterious smile. Very interesting. Goodbye, Vegetoid number two. And I'm going to leave this room now. I almost lost perspective of where I was. What is this? I think it is. It says hit the red switch. Yep. Will do, Captain. And you're a bitch. Oops. Act. Dinner. Ow! Son of a. There you go. Ow! Oh, I'm gonna die before I even get- Ah! Damn it! You know what? I died. I don't care. I don't, I'm probably gonna cut the video there, because it's gonna go right back there. Game over! Our face best spawn you! Um, I think it says Revy if I hit enter. Yep, Revy. Because my name is. Or that's what I hit- Well, in the beginning of the game, it doesn't do- It didn't show this, because I already did it. But, um, in, in the beginning of the game, where you start off, um, it'll ask you to insert human's name here. Insert- Human that drops name here or something like that. So remember, it doesn't say my name. It just says human that's shot that dropped. And it says insert humans. No, it says insert humans name. Sorry, I'm being retarded. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, because uh, I know I'm going to enjoy the heck out of playing through this game. Um, but anyway, hope you guys, like I said, just just like I just said. Anyway. Please leave any kind of feedback, likes, dislikes, that all helps me because it's all constructive. That's the way I see it, anyway. Please sub to this channel and my other channel will be very helpful. Also, favorite, anything like that. All helpful to me. Um. Anyway, have a good day, guys. Peace out.